So let us now try to sketch this parabola and identify the parts. So this is a parabola that is opening to the left. So we can say from its format we're in, the squared variable here is y and 4c is negative. So in reference to the given equation, we can see that the squared quantity here is y. And also, 4c is negative and that would be negative 4c is equal to negative 8. So let's have that here. Negative 4c is equal to negative 8. So these are the information that we would be getting. Opening, vertex, focus, directrix, axis of symmetry, and endpoints of the lattice rectum. So again, this would be facing to the left. And for the vertex, again, this would be at H, K. So here, H is 1 and K is negative 4. So we have this as 1 and negative 4. If you write this equation in this format, we can have this as Y minus, and then we have negative 4 squared. So we have negative times negative 4, that would be positive 4 is equal to negative 4 says negative 8 times x minus 1. That's why we have 1, negative 4 as our vertex. So let's try to sketch the graph of this given parabola. For our vertex, we have 1, negative 4. Let's say this is 1 and this is our negative 4. So this is our vertex. So how do we get the focus? We will refer again to our c value here. So to get c, that would be negative 4 over negative 4, or we will divide both sides by negative 4 to get c. So this would be cancelled. So negative 8 over negative 4, that would be positive 2. Therefore, our focus is 2 units to the left of our vertex. So from 1, negative 4, if that would be 2 units, it will land at negative 1. So this is our focus. So I have this as negative 1, negative 4. For the directrix, if this is 2 units, therefore our directrix would be 2 units to the right of our vertex. And that would be at 3. So the axis is aligned and this is perpendicular to our x-axis. Therefore, the equation of our directrix is x is equal to 3. For the axis of symmetry, here, it passes through the vertex and the focus. And this is perpendicular to our y-axis. So therefore, this would be y is equal to negative 4. For the endpoints of the lattice rectum, we will refer to our 4c here and that would be 8. So 8 divided 2, that would be 4. So you would be doing 4 units upward and 4 units downward from our focus. Because the distance of the two endpoints from each other would be 8 units. So 4 units upward would land here. And 4 units would be somewhere here, and that would be at negative 8. So for the endpoints of the lattice rectum, that would be negative 1, 0, and negative 1, negative 8. And to give you a rough sketch of our parabola, this would be the graph.